I cannot believe it. I wake up this morning, turn on my phone, and guess what I find out? I'm starting seeing crying during memes, trying to figure out what everybody crying and laughing about. And guess what? After six long years, John Cena finally dumped that belly slut. God damn. Before I throw though, I don't want to call me disrespectful, but John Cena and Nikki Bella is over. Officially over. After six years. Then he asked her to marry her last year? Like, did he propose last WrestleMania? Didn't the Miz and Maurice say this shit? Yeah. The real it couple, huh? The it couple is the Miz and Maurice. Come on, man. That's a real couple. They were just together for TV. They only proposed for WrestleMania. All this shit was fake. That's crazy as fuck. It's crazy as fuck. Nikki and John is over. I wonder why they broke up. Did John cheat it? I think John cheated. Maybe Nikki cheated. Oh, I know. Nikki broke one of his house rules. That's what it was. She came home, put her feet on the couch, and drunk soda out of the bed in the bed. <laughs> That's what it was. <laughs> she broke house no rule 5008 dash dash 99. Mm mm mm. That's fucked up. That's fucking crazy. Them niggas is over. Uh huh. So, do y'all think he could get her back? I bet he could get her back. I bet he could get her back. She's completely single. Let's think about it. She's heartbroken right now. Feeling very vulnerable. This sounds like something that Dolph Ziggler would do. Just swoop on down there and say, come here, Nikki. He said, I don't understand. Fuck John. He ain't shit. That motherfucker gonna break up with you and dump you a week before your wedding. That nigga ain't shit. He gonna propose to you at WrestleMania. Watch. Watch. Two months from now, we gonna find out that Dolph Ziggler is back fucking Nikki Bella. That's funny as fuck. A fake couple beat the Miz and Maurice last year at WrestleMania to do a fake ass proposal. And a fucking year later, they they not even get together. Like I said, everything everything them motherfuckers was actually was saying in that fucking in that fucking lead up to that match was true about Nikki and John. It was never going to last. We all knew that shit was coming. Shit is beyond funny. This is so fucking funny. Like this, you this never. It was never going to last. It was never. It was never going to happen. It wasn't. I knew it wasn't going to happen because John Cena would start getting more mainstream. You know what I mean? He started to smell. Mm, I smell more pussy. And what happened? Gone. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> and they supposed to be the couple. The WWE. The WWE's couple. Get the fuck out of here. That's the Miz and Maurice. Dial, John Cena about to turn heel when he come back. This is a, this is a heel moment for him. Oh, was oh did they do this for sweet weeks for ratings for next year total bellas? This probably wasn't total bellas move. This probably was a team move. I mean, just think about it. Tristan Thompson and Kari Kardashian and Kardashian shit just came out right when the new season or the season ended, so they lead into next season to have a big storyline for next season. Just think about that. So, Total Bell is going to have a new storyline. How is Nikki going to deal with a breakup over John? <laughs> Ooh, wow. World. Crazy. Burned. Crazy as hell. <laughs>